Hi YouTube. Uh, first off, I would like to apologize for my last video. As I told you, I had not been doing the vlogging in a long time, and I forgot that I'm not supposed to show any emotion when I do that, so I apologize for the excessive amount of smiling. Moving right along. Thank you all so much, because now I have 10,000 subscribers. That's 2,000 hands worth of them. I had to do that math, and I was, I was struggling with that. Should I be worried about where my math career is headed? Yeah, I just wanted to give a heartfelt and sincere thank you to all of you who are still watching me after these years. I've been on the internet for years actually now, and I'm, I can say that. I've been doing something for years. That's great, because I usually quit stuff. But I stuck with this because of you. Thank you so much for subscribing and watching and commenting and rating and favoriting and sending me messages and like asking me 4,000 form string questions. It's too many. You shouldn't care about anybody that much. Without all of you, I could not be having all the fun I am today. I wouldn't have met a lot of friends. And thank you so much for supporting me. It means a lot. Be tight. Moving right along from that pile of schmaltz. I went and saw Alice in Wonderland last night at the midnight showing. And oh my gosh, it was great. I really enjoyed it. And I saw it in 3D, so I have the 3D glasses. The problem with having real glasses and 3D glasses is you have to choose between do I want to actually be able to see what's going on in the movie or do I want to see it in 3D. And for me I chose 3D which resulted in me getting a splitting headache about halfway through but it was still good. So that is a real testament to its quality. Every time I watch a movie like Alice in Wonderland I just get disappointed that out of all the realities we could have been born into, we were born on Earth where nothing happens. Also, this video is a video response to one of my buddy That Zach's videos where he states that there's always somebody who comes out of the movie with their 3D glasses still on saying, Whoa, everything's in 3D, man. Oh, tight. Oh. Because they're an idiot. And you're absolutely right. I saw no less than four people doing that coming out of the theater, so. Hypothesis confirmed. One of my secret ambitions in life is I want badly to become a stand-up comedian. And as such, I figure I should start building a collection of jokes early. So, I keep a notebook next to my bed. In case I wake up in the middle of the night feeling whimsical. Labeled right on there. Jokes. Just in case I get confused as to what the contents of this journal are. Now, the only problem with writing down jokes right after you like wake up right before you go to sleep and right after you wake up you think a lot of things are funny you'll laugh at pretty much anything when you're really tired and I've noticed that a lot of these jokes are not good simply because of when I wrote them I'm gonna share one with you because I like you guys if it would help you just imagine a brick wall behind me it's a comedy club oh hang on I know how to make this more authentic they have Scrabble on ESPN, they show it on the Sports Network, and I think that's great because not only are they saying that Scrabble is a sport, there are commentators for Scrabble. These are the guys who are not good enough at Scrabble to play professionally, but they know enough about it to deliver a play-by-play. -play. I'm going to keep working on that. And finally, today I was thinking how a lot of teenage celebrities have their own clothing lines and stuff like that, like Miley Cyrus has one, I think, and the Olsen twins and Hilary Duff, and everybody's got one. And that makes me glad I'm not a teen celebrity, because if I was, my clothing line would be like, hey, here's a plaid shirt. Watch out next week, I'm gonna make another one, different colors. Keep you on your toes. Plaid shirts by Adam. And that's it for today. So once again, thank you all for continuing to watch. I hope you still get some small fragments of enjoyment out of these videos. I know I do. <laughs> Thanks again. Bye.